Ze heeft net een gouden plaat ontvangen voor haar grote hit Superstar. En nu zit ze naast mij. Welkom, Jamiria. Hello. First of all, I have to admit, I'm really glad we're doing this interview sitting down. Because, my God, I just saw your legs. And they're so long. I already felt bad. Oh, no, no, no. Don't, don't worry about my legs. You've had quite some setbacks in your career. But now you strike back with an amazing album. Thank you. What are you so thankful for? Um, I'm thankful for everything, the good and the bad, you know, it's, um, it's really good to be back and um, I'm just thankful for all the experiences that have kind of led to me getting to this point and hopefully beyond. Uh, ten of the 14 songs on Thank You, do you feel you have more creative control over the songs you have co-written than over the ones that are written for you? Um, I, I feel that I've had um, creative control over the album as a whole because um, even the songs that I didn't write, they're songs that I selected and um, or songs that were written for me by people who know me. So, um, you know, they definitely don't say anything that I probably wouldn't have said in my own songs. Um, but I absolutely love writing and I love having that creative control, definitely. Yeah. Um, to be quite honest, in this business, you know, um, to kind of speak about certain things isn't isn't the norm but um for me because i'm a songwriter it was, it was very therapeutic for me to write that song and to help me kind of you know deal with that whole situation and so i don't know i just think it's a good kind of outlet for me and um i'm glad that it can kind of inspire other people and um you know just do good what other artists would you like to work with i'd love to work with missy elliott um jay-z craig david um the sugar babes And the darkness. And the darkness. Yes, I love them. <laughs> And the Rasmus as well. I really like them too. Yeah. <laughs> I heard, I read somewhere that you think guys aren't chatting you up anymore because you're famous. But at the same time, rumors go that Usher is more than interested to chat you up. What is that about? Explain. Okay, let's start. Let's start on the guys chatting me up thing. I mean, guys don't chat me up, but it's not as if I'm desperate and I'm like, oh, please, you know, I want someone to chat me up. It's just like, you know, if you're not brave enough, then pss, whatever. Um, and the whole Usher situation, um, yeah, he's a fan. <laughs> Do you get fan mail? Does he write you mail? <laughs> um, no, nah, I mean, we, we text and stuff, and we just we speak on the phone, you know. Yeah, it's, I mean, yeah, we, we don't have a relationship. We're just friends, basically, but, um, you know, yeah, I, I know he likes me. It's all I for you. This is the Music Factory. 